Yo, what is up, everybody? My name is Meow Clown. Today we are playing more Doom 3. I've got the controller, and I've got my buddy. His name is... The Pimp of Hyrule! Nice to see you guys again. Let's do this. I'm so fucking glad I got him to change his name. Alright, no, I still just my, got... Still... Ah! My, still. <laughs> and we've already had our first jump scare. Okay. Ah, uh, I knew that was coming. Anyways. So Fuck, it's, these doors are fucking scaring me. Yeah, okay. That's so the second time I've jumped. We're gonna have some enemies up here, so you're gonna wanna be careful. Uh, try to just back up and straight and keep the aim. Good kill. Ooh. That was his first time what? playing this game. He just nailed that guy. X is a reload, by the way. Figured that out. Alright, so. Alright, so. Five, what? A minute in. He's got a jump scare. I yes. jumped twice at a door. And then I see the alien guy, and I fucking freak out let's and shoot around. Let's stop the body falling out of the ceiling. So let's get moving here. There's gonna be a lot of enemies in this area, so yeah. you're gonna want to stay away from those explosive barrels. If they okay. get shot, they will kill you. Also, watch out. There's going to be debris falling from the ceiling. That will instantly kill you if it hits you. Good jump. I have no idea how you managed to jump that, but that was awesome. Don't get too close to these guys, but also don't get too far away, as they will throw fireballs ah. at you and lunge at you. The farther you are away, the more they will spam those God techniques. his ass. Alright guys, that was good. Don't All right, worry. Watch the debris falling on the stairs. Look up, make sure you're watching. That's what I'm talking about. That will kill you if it hits you. So, don't walk underneath that. Look behind you as you go up the stairs. There's going to be some enemies rushing you. To your right. And if you look at the councils, like the computer screen right here, if you wait, you can actually see pentagrams flashing behind the screen. So, you know, you'll have to look close, but you can actually kind of see in the background. We'll get, it'll get clearer as we go through the game. You got, just got this warning offline sensors, uh, but as you get closer to the end of the game, you're going to see more distinct <laughs> pentagram images behind everything. These are basically aliens slash demons. Um, I'm not going to ruin too much of the game, but uh, basically you're going to have to stop an alien incursion on Mars. Basically, what's going on here? Because they're trying to make holy it shit. Earth, and we are at negative 849 health, folks. <laughs> so this is why you save constantly. Uh, and Damn. that range on those imps, but you're not gonna get the jump scares this time. So right? Watch, I'm gonna go through the door. And it's gonna fucking scare me. <laughs> so just <laughs> just head through that door. Uh, keep your wits about. Try not to spam your gun too much. Don't waste ammo like he did. Okay. Uh, I got this, guys. Try banking grenades. You should go to a bank and try and... This is Sergeant Kelly. Did I go to the wrong one? By an you went to force. the wrong one. Whoops! Take two, guys. This one. Yeah. No. Yes. You sure? Yeah, because the other oh. one was 627. Alright. So, this is 640 AM. But you okay? Well, maybe. Don't you fucking maybe me. I know what I'm doing maybe. now. I'm a fucking <laughs> pro at this game now. All right. Don't you fucking worry. All right. So we're gonna load up and give this a second try here. Sorry guys, I suck. That it's was his first time playing this game, so maybe that's we should why, do that's it. That's why they love you. So. Fuck you. Hello. Watch those stairs. It comes right out. Okay, that's good, bro. As I said, headshots will kill them faster. Fuck! Nice. Okay, so a little more ammo that time, but he still killed it. Did something. Watch the, uh, like I said, watch that debris that falls. Good shot. That's what you do. Oh. Watch that debris. Yeah. Up. Steps my toe there. If they get close, if the imps get close to you or they lunge at you, just whip out your shotgun. Show them who's boss. Okay. You got someone coming through that door. This is where I'd say pull up the shotgun. Yeah, a few shotgun rounds. Make sure you keep your guns reloaded as well. I'd reload the shotgun. Yep. 
they don't reload themselves when you switch. So if you're in a tight situation, you have an unloaded gun, you're gonna regret it. There's one enemy in here, so be careful. He revives as soon as you go down to the bottom. He's to your left. There he is. You wanna wanna make sure you kill this guy, shoot his body. Oh, he's got a shotgun, what am I doing? Pull out your shotgun. Eh. Eh. Don't panic. As with every game, panicking leads to death, but there's some That's armor. Good. There's going to be a health uh, station out head to your left. Uh, don't unlock that yet. Uh, okay. Go to your left. You're going to want to stock up on health if you've taken any hits. There's going to be a few of those. These are going to be your saviors. All right. Nailed it. You're going to want a security checkpoint. Especially on Nightmare. On Nightmare, there are very few health packs as well as ammo. So, those health checkpoints are going to be your absolute friend. Hey, get. He's in there, so he's going to try to jump scare you when you go in there. Okay. Uh, but there's going to be some guys coming at you with shotguns, so try to keep your distance. Give them a few shots. Headshots huh. kill. They've got helmets, so they're going to take a few more hits, but they should go down after like a clip or two of pistol ammo. Pull out your shotgun for this next area. It's going to be close combat. You're just going to kill this imp and we're going to move on. Fuck. You got him. Headshot. All nice units. job. This is Sergeant All right. Kelly. So, All go back, back, go back into the first area. Orders. Uh, yeah. To your left. All right. So, there should be a command council. Yeah, well, yeah. Restock your health if you have some left. There should be a canal, uh, command council to unlock the uh, gun station. But if not, we can just move on. Yeah, I don't see it. Maybe to your left? No? Okay. Maybe just move on. Oh. Maybe you can't get it. Well, that sucks. We're going to have to wait to get a machine gun. That's fine. That's upsetting. You can go see if you can open it. Oh, nice shot. Nice shot. And there's going to be a zombie oh. coming out of the elevator. He reacted oh. quite well. I don't know if that scared him or not. I was waiting Fuck. to see if he'd yell. I was taking my sip of Mountain Dew. Okay. I'm about ready to laugh. <sighs> Fuck. But he handled it like a champ. So we're going to move on to the real game now. What? That was a tutorial area. Fuck. So if you had trouble with that, you're gonna have tons of fun with this next area. Twice as many imps, lots of shotgun wielders, and we're gonna be moving on to machine gunners. So, machine gunners do a lot of damage to you over time and have quite a bit more range and damage output than shotgun users. Did I do good? You did fine, son. I did fine? Fine's not good enough! Saving. Improve your game skills. <laughs> and then shall be my equal. Equal! Huh. All right. Huh. All remaining marine units. So we're going to move this out here. There's going to be an enemy immediately to your right coming out from behind those boxes. He went too far right. <laughs> said immediately to my right. The fuck do I keep doing that? Yeah, that's, that was poor word choice on my, my end. Sorry about that. You're going to be able to open this if you get a PDA. Uh, this is already open for you, uh, but... Like, these, any of these, uh, if you get the what? PDA. Hey, what's up? <laughs> your first living soul you get to I talk to. And don't alive. just save and then die. I can't believe I found you. Something happened. I don't know what. It, it was like a shockwave. It, it passed through the entire base. People started changing. It was crazy. I, I was working up here on the vent shafts. I don't know how I survived. Go for help. Please. The vent shafts are a terrible place to be. You'd think he would have been the first to die. And he just said go for help. Yeah. So he wants me you to go get I am a gopher. Yeah, and you are the help because Is he important? Leave him alone. Let him let him die in peace, because he's gonna get ripped apart by him. So if you no kill way. him now, you're just you know, Ah, I can't gonna, kill him! You're not gonna let him uh It's upsetting. Anyways, let's move on. Alright. We're gonna duck. And you don't want to no. kill. The future people are important. 
some of them are going to lead you through areas, so be careful when you kill people right off, right off the bat. You can actually kill them, but we'll let you do that if you wish. Let's move on. You left. There's no enemies up here, so you don't have to be too cautious. Is this hurt? No. Okay. You can walk Yay. through that. Uh, there is enemies down below you, though. Tons of enemies. You can hear them breathing. Yeah, I can. That There's going to be an enemy, asshole. like, right in there. You're going to want to be prepared for this. a big fight down here. There's going to be tons Fucking of enemies. Jesus. To your left. Yep. To your behind you as well. There's a bunch of them to your right. Alright, uh, you're gonna be careful. Uh, there's gonna be enemies coming through that door like crazy. Okay, making right. sure. Did I miss anything? No, but there's gonna be tons of enemies in that hallway, including shotgun, dude. And there's gonna be tons of people coming at you here, so you wanna make sure you're prepared. Don't spam too much ammo, you're gonna want that shotgun. It's Oops. going to save your ass. You go do this. Alright. Alright, let's move on. Uh, to your right, you're gonna wanna go through that door. You've got a machine gun user, so pull out your shotgun and get rid of them really fast. Like I said, machine gun users are going to kick your ass, so you're gonna wanna kill them as quickly as possible. But you get a machine gun out of it. So, you know, good and the bad. That's gonna be your go-to weapon after you get enough ammo for it. Um, but for now, you're not going to have enough ammo. That uh, imp isn't going to be able to hit you. Yep. It's uh, going to do what it did last, the last one did, so. Yeah. Just yeah. hide in the room. Pick that Nailed up. It. Uh, that, every time you pick up an item, get ready for new enemies. Because it usually spawns new enemies. Look to your left. Make sure there's nothing in the back of you. Always look behind you and backtrack first. Uh, look to your last known RP and fortify your position. We'll find you. Eh. There we go. You want to you're gonna want to kill these guys uh, as quick as possible because you're gonna be taking some damage here. Uh, there's gonna be tons more enemies, so good shooting, good shooting. Thank you, thank you. All right, so we're gonna go through here. You're getting better, you're getting better. There's PDA to your right. Pick that up. Uh, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That? Oh, that's a battle out there. Where is There's it? a guy behind you. What? There's a guy behind you. There is a guy behind you. What behind me? Left. <laughs> like you have yet to turn around. This? So yeah, that. Okay. There's guys in there. I heard him walking around, so that's why I said something. Where's uh? All right. Where's the fucking PDA bitch. Uh, you, I thought you already picked it up, but maybe that was just the pass card and the health pack. So. So I gotta shoot go to each left. of those guys, maybe. No. Just okay. go to your left first. Uh, there's gonna be a dark room. You're gonna want your shotgun out. There's gonna be quite a few people in here. You're gonna want. There's gonna be an imp in here and bunches of zombies. Make sure you're doing quick sweeps and just take them out. Quick and methodical. Watch for imps. Watch your corners. Ah, thought I killed him. You're good. You're good. Watch it. There's a guy to your left. That's my right. That, that was left. There's a guy behind you as well, apparently, though. So you got it. Alright. Uh, reload your shotgun. Make sure you're set here. Uh, watch your flashlight ammo. Yep. Or your flashlight battery, I should say. Ammo. Same thing. Nice. <laughs> so, you're gonna go through the door to your right. Alright. So there's gonna be an enemy right coming down the hallway. What are they? To your, to your left. Watch. Those guys will hurt you really bad, so you want to kill those as quick as possible. They're on fire. Uh, there's not too many of those enemies in the game, but they will kill you pretty quickly, so. Good shot. There's going to be more coming around from the left and right, so be very careful. That's not a good range. You can reload your uh, machine gun. I don't know how much ammo you have on that, but... I'll take it! All right. You've got some ammo for your machine gun at this point, so you can use that, but use it sparingly. If you spam it too much, you're going to be out. Um, but that's going to be your go-to power weapon for most of the game. There's going to be an enemy to your left. Oh, maybe you already killed him. Nope, no, he's still there. These uh, fat guys take a lot of damage, but they're not too dangerous. I hear another one. 
Not in there. There's that behind you. Uh, machine gun actually does quick quick work of uh, most imps. So if you're running along shot, uh, shotgun, you can just switch to your machine gun. That should help with the distance. You can keep more of a distance with the machine gun, which is very helpful. And also reloads much quick, much more quickly. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, you're gonna want to use that if you need to. If not, just leave it alone. If you're pretty full on health, I would just leave it. You can always backtrack if you get hurt. Um, in here, there should be a PDA with a code for this. Uh, most lockers will have a PDA nearby that unlocks it. Um, a lot of them require some backtracking. Um, but always check the PDA. So we got Mark Cabion. We're going to go in our PDA. We're going to listen to uh, Mark Audio here. Audio log for Dr. Cassian, currently stationed at Mars City. I have just left the weekly status meeting here in medical. The most prominent topic was the vast number of psychological He's going to tell you about the psychological uh, condition the of a lot of the patients. That but if you actually the look, there are multiple audio reports on a lot of them. If you look at many people the will not come in for this title type of, of thing, the audio log, a, number of a lot of them will have hints be in the to which one will contain a code. Range. Like a patient attack, maybe that would be a good reason to have a locker with some ammunition in it. So let's listen to that one really fast. Dr. Mark Casian, at 1547... Patient Jonathan Wills was admitted after complaining of insomnia and nausea. And you can actually According back to the nurse, out Mr. Wills was calm and still played the most time audio. Disorder. So if you're getting attacked, to exam room five. make sure you back out. However, by the time I reached him at ten after four, his personality had changed dramatically. When I entered the room, Mr. Wills lunged at me with a scalpel he apparently stole from a supply drawer. With the assistance of an orderly, we managed to subdue and sedate him without injury. Mr. Wills was heavily medicated and could not be diagnosed, but in the 20 minutes he was left unattended, he managed to carve three symbols in his arm and cut his own tongue into two halves. I, I can only guess at the cause of his problems. I hope that additional psychiatrists arrive soon. In the meantime, in response to this assault, all medical supplies and armaments will be locked in a secure hospital we cabinet go. with the code 347. Dr. Casey and out. <laughs> Wrong button, guys. Sorry. 347. And that should open. Bingo. <laughs> Armor, some medication, some shells, and a clip for your machine gun. Very nice. He is nice. Very nice. He is Very nice. nice. Does, is it like you just gain and gain and gain and gain ammo, or does it have a cap? Um, I really think it does have a cap, however, I am not sure. I think it does have a cap. Um, so I should uh, use this every once in a while? The machine gun's cap, I think, is 480. Don't quote me on that. Uh, so you you shouldn't be full on ammo ever on any gun, to be honest, because you should be swapping between guns rather, rather frequently to keep your ammo supplies quite regular on each gun, so you have a gun for every situation. If you rely too heavily on a specific gun, you're going to be in trouble. Watch out, there's some more guys with guns coming in to your right. Give them a good shot. Headshots, like I said, do more damage. The machine gun is a very powerful weapon. So. And is the go-to of most marines on the base. You're gonna fight a lot of those guys with machine guns. You're gonna see less and less of the shotguns as time goes on. And eventually, you're just going to start fighting demon creatures as you get for further and further in the game. But for now, you're going to fight uh, possessed marines, basically. you got a few enemies in here, including a fire demon. You're going to want to keep your distance from that. Nailed it! Alright. Keep thinking RB is to reload. It's not. No, switch weapons. There we go. We're in. Dick. Uh, Dick. You, uh, from how much machine gun ammo is in this mission, you can get away with using the machine gun quite frequently, but just be aware of your ammo. Always okay. pay attention. You're running out of uh, pistol ammo at this point, so I would actually lay off the pistol for a little bit. Also, reload all your guns. Make sure they're all reloaded. Pistol is not reloaded. Oh, one bullet! There you go. Always make sure your guns I'm are can't fully go loaded, there. because one bullet might make the difference between life and death. You never know. Can you crouch? can crouch and go underneath. You almost uncrouch right now that fire, though. 
Right. The fire does a lot of damage to you very quickly, so if you even touch it, you're going to be hurting. Those bit, are bit. both broken doors, but you're going to get a PDA from back here. What you need to pick up, you just walk on it. I hear noise. That is a PDA with higher access levels. To your right, that door's broken. There's no enemies that are going to be coming through there. Those doors are both broken. Crouch. But picking up that PDA causes more enemies to spawn. Look to your left. Always check behind you. Alright, that's good habit. And then, uh, clear your corners. Make sure you're not running into anything. A marine just got strangled by a zombie. That guy must be very ineffective as a combatant. Hey, it's that guy earlier that pointed and we completely ignored him. And went the wrong way. That's what he gets for being a dick and telling me what, how to live my life. Alright, pull out your pistol. Hey, look, the armory. Maybe we can get that fancy plasma rifle, right? Uh, be careful when you go in there. There's gonna be some enemies. Most of these bodies are dead. Um, okay. so you're good. Um, just, when you go in here, uh, watch your back, because you will spawn some enemies. Oh, no! It's no entry! Oh, no! There must be a PDA nearby. Uh, look to your left. There should be, uh, some shotguns and machine guns in there, which is helpful, and get some ammo. But the plasma rifle, of course, is missing. Of course. That would be too easy. Alright, so All there's right. that broken door. You're just going to want to go in here. This is where we started out at, so... Connection. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. That's weird. I believe right, still you've alive. got audio. I'm unable to return to Mars with City Mr. Mr. Kelly talking to you, which we're not going to watch, apparently. <laughs> setting up a command Sorry. post here. I can monitor status reports of the entire base from Delta Central Authority and communicate with other Marine teams. It's your mission to link up with Bravo team and get that transmission sent. Head toward Alpha Labs. It's the fastest way to find them. I'll update your PDA security clearance from here. Good job. He's and good luck, Marine. He's gonna update your security clearance, so now you can get into even more doors. More doors. More doors! It's a crappy game. Alright. <laughs> Back behind you. Turn around. Uh, just always check areas. The door's gonna be broken, so... No! Never mind. We're going through here, look around. That's still closed, but I don't know, there might be a PDA if you look around, and it'll give you the code. We did not find it, though, uh, and I forgot the specific location. Um, if you'd like to know the location, I can revisit this mission if you would like to know PDA. We can do a collectible video and show you where all the ammo caches are at and everything. That's uh, completely acceptable, but for now, we're just going to focus on getting through the game. Alright. Um... Alright, so, it's the only thing to do now is move on, so we're going to head back to our starting area, to Wait. the left. Where? Keep going this way. Okay. There you go, head left. Back to where we came in at, in the start of the game, where you can hear people coming through those, be careful. There's going to be people trying to shoot you. Good sh uh, in front of you too, so watch out behind you. Yep. Pull out your machine gun, probably a good place for it. <laughs> the door will close on you. <laughs> Yeah, pulse fire. That helps conserve ammo. That's exactly what you need to do. And not miss. <laughs> but you got it. Good job. Got so we ass. cleared, and we've got quite a bit of shotgun ammo. And if you've done it right, you should have some ma ammo amassed, so you're not going to be hurting for ammo for now. I'll look to your... Uh, always clear corners if there's any areas that look suspicious. You're probably going to want to look before you leap, if you know what I mean. Hey, dickhead. Dickhead. Okay, so we're still good. Med kit. Good thing I was assed up to a med kit. Or uh, is that automatic? Do I just pick them up? Alright, so. Thought that was Monopoly money for a second. Right, turn on your flashlight, check corners. Med pack, I think. Alright, so in here does seem to be clear. Don't go out there yet. I'll head back. Make sure you just check all your corners, go through all the doors before you move on. Hey, that room where we spied on people. Yeah, we're still moving on kind of fast, but there's pl plenty of ammo and stuff if you stick around and you don't just keep wandering through doors. Go back to the other area. We're back to uh, this place. Go the other way. Oh, other way? Ah. Yeah, we, this is where we started at. We went the wrong way. That's why I said hold on and go back the way you came. Okay, right? Right here? Yeah. Alright, so go left. 
back in here. Turn your flashlight on. And this is where we killed all the enemies, so it should be clear. But all enemies are always spawning. Don't go through here yet. Alright, so go back through those doors that way. Um, left. Right. Get some armor if you need it. Should be a pretty full armor as well. Go to your left first. Not that left. You went way too far left. That one. Clear out from in there. See? Always check your areas. Fuck, what? What's up? He's trying to snipe with a shotgun. <laughs> Got him down. Nice. Don't judge me with my shotgun, alright? <laughs> he is terrible at this reload and stuff. Alright. You got him down. He's getting better at this combat, though. Alright, so to your left. Make sure that's cleared out. There's a guy in there. Got him. Just take a look around. If there's anything you download, there's a council behind you. Yep. On the wall. See right it. There. Let's always read councils to see what it says. Nothing's on there that interests us. So just turn around. Go at the door to the left. So we're going to be moving on here. This is the cafe. There's going to be a few zombies in here, but it's not too bad. Marine, if you run across any operational sentry bots, use them. Those guys have a lot of firepower. Got them. Hey, the chicken turbo puncher's offline. No! Was that convincing? Alright, so, you already picked up the PDA earlier. Oh, so. oh. Good shot. Good shooting. Use your cover whenever you get it, because the more you stand out in the open, the more you get hit. Alright, reload your gun. Make sure that's all set up. You're terrible. <laughs> Hit the it. X button. Got there it! You go. Alright, so we're gonna head into that bathroom, and bathroom in any horror game is always bad news. So, make sure you're ready for every bathroom. Check the stalls. Shotguns are always a good idea in bathrooms because it's close quarters. Uh, imps like to crawl out of the ceiling in bathrooms. What? Uh, if you ever come across the bathroom, make sure you watch behind you and everything. Um, you can look at yourself and with all your guns. Oh! Uh oh, one of those jump scares. Oh, look behind you. Put a flashlight on. Oh, and he's killing him. Oh no! You could have worked a shotgun. There, bud. there you go. Feel yeah. safer with a with a with a rifle. All right. Not necessarily. Shotguns are always good for your health with close combat, uh, more than a machine gun. But definitely have some ammo for everything. All right, so we're gonna move on. Some more guys with shotguns. Not too bad. He's got battle armor, which makes him a little difficult to kill. Hate those. Fuck fuckers. me, dude. Man, eventually, he will remember that that's switching weapons. He's retarded. Don't shoot that. If you shoot those, they'll shoot you. Um, they're sentry bots. You can just follow them. They will conserve your ammo as they take out enemies for you. So just follow them and protect them. Uh, make sure they're not getting too beat up. They will break eventually if you uh, let them take too much damage. But they will fucking mow down your enemies for you. Let that do most of the fighting, but if something's double teaming it or uh, behind it, take those out. It'll save your health and your ammo. It's always smart to use your surroundings to kill people instead of just straight bullets. That'll help you conserve ammo, especially if you're playing Nightmare. You want every opportunity to conserve ammo, explosive barrels, the like. Green, you gotta get to Bravo team quickly. They need all the firepower they can get. Sending that transmission is critical to our survival. Pretty fast, though, because of your uh, little sentry buddy. Watch that barrel. You never know what's explosive and what's not. Uh, mostly only the red barrels are explosive, but there are a few. They're getting. Fuck! 
and he's panicking. And when you panic, bad stuff happens. Don't panic. If you're getting hit, just calmly switch to your next weapon. Get rid of them. Shotguns save your life in that case. Fuck you! Alright, so it's, you know, it knows eventually we'll reach its shutdown point, and which point, obviously, the, all the enemies start spawning, because <sighs> that's how this game works. Uh, so, you're gonna wanna uh, go explore everywhere before you go up this elevator. Uh, this is pretty much the end of this area. Uh, we're gonna go in here really fast and look around. Jump up, jump up and get down. Sorry. Yeah. Whoa. Alright. Don't so like that as a crouch. We're gonna go up the elevator now. And, yeah, uh, have to. Alright. What's on the top of the elevator? I don't know. But you're gonna have to find out next time. Because oh, we're shit. running out of time here. Oh, so, shit. So, I guess we have another c c c cliffhanger. So this is this is Meow Clown. And the Pimp of Hyrule. And you, we'll let the pro get back on it. So thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. See you later.